I had uh, remembered something back around uh, 1972. I was living, uh, I had actually moved down to New York City from Tubelo, Mississippi. Uh, and I ran, I came across this building, uh, the sheds for rent, multiple apartments. And so I, I went in and I filled out an application and before I could finish, the owner walked in and said uh, that they were all booked up. And I asked for his name. And he said, uh, I'm Mr. Drunk. <laughs> I said, Mr. You say Drunk? Yeah, he said, I'm Mr. Drunk. And I said, well, uh, I said, I said, well, Mr. Drunk, the sign says, uh, 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 there's a multiple apartments uh, for rent here, and I would like to rent one of them right now. I said, right now. I want to rent one right now. So he paused for a moment and said, well, you know, you know what, I think I do have one, and uh, he said, follow me. So we went to the elevator, and he punched, he pushed the uh, down button. I said, well, Mr. Drunk, uh, I wanted that deluxe apartment in the sky. Why are we going down? So he smiled at me and he said, well, I got a special one just for you. So we went uh, to the basement, uh, down to the basement, and then down another two flights of stairs. I'm like, I'm wondering to myself, what the hell, we're going, we're going to hell? Well, what the hell we're going? And then I said, well, Mr. Drunk, uh, there's an awful lot of pipes showing. Did y'all forget to add the walls? So we get to a door that said maintenance. Hmm. And he opened the door and said, this is the only room you'll stay in in my building, and there's a toilet clogged up on the tenth floor, and walked out the room. He just walked out the room. Took me 45 minutes to get that damn toilet working. <laughs>